Hi guys! So, I've gotten a new notebook. This is a Speckled Fawns Pocket Size Cafe Vanilla. And it is not available at the website anymore, so I got this off the BSG group. Um, it's, a it's a really soft and scrumptious leather. I just take this out. You can see it's really, really, really soft. And it is, it is really yummy, really, really yummy. Um, and I don't think it will scratch that easily either. You can mostly rub out the scratches. Let's see if I show you here. Yeah, and you just rub it out. So this notebook will age quite slowly. Um, it is a one inch spine, but I'm going to show you. There is a difference. So here you go. All right. This is a one and a half inch spine with six elastics. And this is a one inch spine with four elastics. But due to the design, this one is actually made to wrap around your inserts more easily. It's hard to show you when you doesn't have when you don't have anything in it, but it it's like a it folds more, so you can fit quite a lot in here. I have moved everything from this one that I haven't had in here to this one, um, and that is my wallet insert, my junk journal, and my quick info book. So, all this that I needed to move into my one and a half inch spine reinforced, but anyhow, one and a half inch spine I can fit in this without an issue. There are some overhang, um, but due to the leather wrap, it doesn't really matter because it doesn't cut into the inserts at all. If I had had an elastic, I think it would have cut into the inserts, but uh. I am not sure that I will keep the leather wrap. Uh, it's quite, it's quite a procedure to open it up when you're at a store. I'm gonna pay something, and you're like, "Ah, oh, wait a minute! Quickly unwrap it and take your things out, and then wrap it up again." And yeah, it's a procedure. So I might switch out to the elastics anyway, and then I have to look like see if they cut into my inserts or not. But. Uh, this is a freaking gorgeous notebook. Oh my god. And it's so funny because when I first started using notebooks, I hated floppy leather. I hated this non-structural kind of leather. I, I felt like, oh, I need something firm and sturdy that doesn't fold like however when I open it. But I have come to realize that I really like more floppy leathers. Rustic Kodiak does have some structure to it due to the pocket mostly. So if I, I would have gotten a Rustic Kodiak with no pockets, just a classic, then then it would have been really floppy. But uh, this is just this is just amazing, the scrumptiousness of soft leathers. And then I have my snickerdoodle, which is really sturdy and everything, but uh, that's another thing. This leather here, if you ever get a chance to get it, do it, because it is so heavenly smooth and buttery and... Oh, it's really lovely. I am so, so, so happy that I got this. I didn't know what I had missed. <laughs> I was actually thinking about getting one of these in the early beginnings when I found Speckled Fawns. They had... Cafe Vanilla, and I think it was Tall Soy on the website, but I hesitated and, well, then they were gone. But now I have this, and it is so, so, so gorgeous. And, yeah, I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna fill it up, and then I'm gonna show you how it looks like. So, stay tuned, another video is coming up right up. Bye guys.